Dangerous bite. A common Ohio mosquito is now spreading a serious virus. Two people in the state are already sick. The mosquitoes are, are back for yeah. the summer and that we need to um, think about when they're going to be out. We are looking into whether any cases hit the tri-state and what you can do to keep you and your family safe. Nine on your side, Jay Warren is live with the risks to watch out for. Jay. Well, Tanya, by, mo by now most of us have heard about the West Nile virus, but since July 4th there have been 50 reported cases of the chikungunya virus, and infectious disease experts say that the mosquito that carries that virus is in the tri-state. A day in the park in Westchester was perfect for these kids, but with the warm weather comes a familiar pest. It's the beginning of the summer. I think it's just starting to creep into people's minds that the mosquitoes are, are back. Lucy England's four-year-old son had a run-in two weeks ago. His legs still bear the result of some of the bites. We were at my mom's house. She lives in Mount Healthy, and he was out around dusk, and he got about six bites on each leg and woke me up in the middle of the night crying because these bug bites itch so badly. Fortunately, he did not develop any of the symptoms of this infectious disease. Dr. Carl Fitchenbaum, a professor of clinical medicine at the University of Cincinnati's Medical School, says, as always, people should make efforts to protect themselves. Try to avoid the times at dawn and dusk when mosquitoes are out the most. Uh, if you're going to be outside, it's better to wear long sleeves or mosquito repellent if you can. Uh, that's the best way to avoid a mosquito bite. Now, health officials say that a majority of the cases have been noticed in Florida, brought in by, through uh, the Caribbean, actually. And one other tip for people out there is to avoid standing water anywhere near your house and tip out old tires to get the water out of that. It stops the breeding of mosquitoes. Jay Warren, 9 on your side, Westchester. Okay, Jay, thanks. And here are the symptoms you should watch out for. Fever and joint pain are the most common. You could also have a headache, muscle pain, joint swelling, or a rash. These symptoms usually start three to seven days after your bit. As far as treatment, there is currently no medicine. But to decrease symptoms, get plenty of rest, drink fluids, medicines like ibuprofen may help relieve any fever and pain.